This is the multivine trellising system. It is made for the climbing, uh, climbing or creeping vines like the cucumber, uh, bitter gourd, and uh, string beans. And here is the single span plant riser. It has a uh, rain shelter to protect the plants from the strong splash of rain strong rain splash so underneath is uh, about five female chicken and uh, one male that's a one is to five ratio they have their own uh, feeding feeding through and water through this single span riser and the rest of the risers is uh, being uh, irrigated through this uh, water tray uh, by uh, through Bell Siphon uh, sub irrigation system. We have the the A plant riser. This is the A plant riser. Um, it also has this uh, rain shelter and uh, each of this uh, rain shelter has its own gutter to collect the water and be uh, collected in that uh, water tank there that's it that's a water tank about uh, 400 liters and uh, this A riser also has the uh, chicken coop underneath. We have this about um, we have about uh, ten, oh no, five uh, female and one male also. The male is uh, perching there, and the female there, about uh, four there and one. And uh, by the way, this uh, this uh, growing box, this uh, called this tetra pot, it's made of uh, discarded uh, plant juice container. I oh, no no, uh, juice container, and um, we collected them and uh, sow them. Um, uh, connect every juice pack and make a tetra pack there's some uh, various vegetables and herbs here they grow nicely uh, because of uh, this uh, good irrigation technique the sub irrigation and here's the other the other uh, single span plant riser also with a uh, rain shelter and gutter by the way, that uh, air riser also has this gutter. Once it rains, it collects the water and drops the water through this uh, spout here. And uh, it refills the, or it will replenish the, the pond. And here are the chicken here. That's it. And of course, this the the dung. They're not supposed to to drop in in the pond you're supposed to be collected here this is the uh, we call this polycarbonate dung collector here once the they're full uh, we collect them and uh, this is the back side of the uh, a plant uh, no, single span plant riser with uh, another five chicken in there and we have this uh, uh, multivine trellising system the other side because we do a symmet symmetrical arrangement to one uh, one multivine on the left and one multivine on the right same is 
with a single span one single span and the middle a plant riser the other single span is there there this is single span there and this uh, cucumber are already fruiting at the fruiting stage there they look good there and uh, we also have this uh, outside this uh, 125 square meter garden we have this uh, chicken range there it's about uh, 150 square meter contains about uh, 100 to 200 chicken and surrounded by climbing um, you can grow cucumber and uh, uh, bitter gourd or this uh, lufa and uh, this is the full view of that garden there it has some symmetrical form there at the back of this garden we have the composting facilities there's the fish there. there's some fish there it's a fingerling this is our barrel composter two barrel composter and two uh, fermenting barrel you notice we use the PVC concreted PVC so that it will last longer it's very strong you can't even move it they're all concrete with some reinforcement bars here's the fermenting barrel number two we collect all the waste liquid waste here we put a, a basin here and here's the semi-composted biodegradable Here's the tank and here's the hip composter. It's where we put the garden waste. We don't we, we don't burn waste, we just put in there. We allow air, water, sunlight to help degrade it. And underneath this is the uh, vermi vermi bin, but for now we we use it to grow a solar. And uh, we have this drain here. There. There's the drain. There. See that? So, here's the... Here's where we collect the vermi tea. And... Uh, and on the perimeter side the, the the perimeter of this garden is surrounded by plants herbs like uh, eggplant tomato and some herbs there here are my two trainees here the two young ladies <laughs> and here's the master con I go Lodok. He's constructing a channel or the chicken tunnel for the chicken to just uh, walk in here and uh, move across this, this, across the garden to the other side of the garden. This is about 500 square meter waiting for approval from the uh, Department of Agriculture through ATI as a learning site so that's it and uh, here's Jojo Rom the founder of Urban Container Garden in the Philippines thank you